weighted cardio workout. And so what we're gonna do, the first movement is gonna be a side to side. So we're gonna step to the side and just do a little hop, okay? Exercise. Go a little heavier on the weights if you want. We're gonna work in 45 seconds of work with a 15 second break in between, okay? So this is a weighted cardio, but of course your option is, the first beginner option is just to do this without the weight. Okay, I want you to sink low, drop your butt, and sit back, okay? I'm just gonna drive up and over. You can also put your weights right on your shoulders to make it a little bit easier. If this bothers your back, your option is to have the weight down here, okay? We're almost there. Nice, okay. The next move is gonna be a twist, twist, knee. Twist, twist, knee. Okay, I want you to kind of practice that. It's two twists with a knee. Twist, twist, so that we can alternate knees. One, two, knee. We're gonna go a little bit faster. Good, keep your abs in, your chest up. If you wanna make it a little harder, down a little bit deeper in between. Okay, you can always also slow it down. Good, we got 15 seconds left. Stay with it. Good, five more seconds. All right, our third move is a kettlebell swing. Now, you might not have a kettlebell and that's okay. I'm gonna use a little bit of a heavier, regular hand weight. It's very similar, so wide stance. You're gonna sit back and drive it up, okay? I want you to thrust those hips forward as you drive your heels into the floor and you're looking to bring the weight level with your shoulders. I'll show you the side view and sit back. Okay, sit back and swing it through your legs, keeping your chest up and your, your hips sit deep. Good, keep going. 10 more seconds. those three moves two more times. Are you ready? So bringing it back to the side to side butt. Exercise. And you can do this at your own pace. Whatever feels right. Just challenge yourself. Okay? These are short 10 minute workouts means you can increase your intensity a little bit. Push a little harder since it's not so long. Okay. Fifteen seconds. Keep going, come on, sit your butt back. Last one. Good job. Now you can always also lighten the weight. So I'm gonna do a twist, twist knee. Twist, twist knee. You can have both, both weights at the same time. Knee. Good, now that twist action really puts some work in your abs. So make sure that you pull your belly button in Standing up nice and tall. Even if you're sinking deeper into the legs, they still want your upper body sitting up tall. Good, 15 seconds. I know I'm out of breath. Are you there? That's good. Things we're warming up. Good. If you want, 
increase the weight. You can usually go a little heavier on these kettlebell swings, but you can get her bigger muscle group. There you go. Exercise. Drop. Up. Now, we're still coming to shoulder level on this one. On the third one, on this next round, I'm gonna push you a little bit harder, okay? If you want. So, but for now, a okay, power driving that, that swing comes from your legs and your glutes and your abs. Keep breathing. Exhale. You ready for the last and final round? I believe we're already almost there. Back to those side to side squats. Exercise. Here we go. Good. This time, I want you to really focus. Putting just a little more intensity into each set, okay? A little more work to make it a little tougher. Just to the finish line. Got it? I know you do. Come on. 15 seconds. Good job. All right. So we've got two more to go. Back to that twist, twist knee. You can do two weights or choose to just do one. It doesn't really matter. Twist, twist, knee. Are you ready? Go. Twist, twist, knee. One, two, up. Really using my oblique as I lift that knee in front of me. A lot of people like to do this, right? You throw that knee to the side. I want you to try to bring it up in front of your hip so that you can really work that oblique, really squeeze. Okay. What? Ah, yes. Okay, we got 15 seconds left. Keep your shoulders up, chest up, form at the very end. It is so important. So don't sacrifice your form for speed, but you know, bring the intensity too. Good. Last one, let's get in that kettlebell swing. Remember I said I'm gonna challenge you a little bit more on this one. So you're gonna sit back, you're gonna drive it all the way up over your head, okay? You swing it up, bring it down, push. All right, here we go. 45 seconds on the clock and then you're done with the cardio for today, okay? Remember, you're pushing your butt back, it's all the way to the top. Come on. 20 more seconds with me. Woo. Drive those heels into the floor. Push, push, push through the hips, through the glutes. 10 seconds. Finish strong. Good. Awesome, you guys.